Hey guys, welcome to this video. Uh, in this video, I'm going to explain uh, this question that Sayonat uh, had. I was asking to have a, a you are here uh, location thing inside the floor plan. So I decided to build that. And as you can see over here, we have the you are here thing showing up. We go to the next one and we even get a checkbox to see that we've visited this panorama. And when we go to the next one, also this one is showing up. We can go back. This is what we're going to build. So let's dive into that. So as you can see, I've uh, removed everything. And uh, going back to the project, what I already have set up is uh, the floor plan itself in the skin. So a floor plan viewer, a floor plan, and, and there are actions on all of those open panorama like so and i've added radars already to all those things and those are explained in my previous video how to build radars so those are the things that i've already set up now the extra things to, to do here is to have a ui here image hotspot on top of the one that you already have and as you can see i have the same with number seven and the same with number eight i've placed those on top and to make the you are here work, we need to go to the panoramas. And we click once on one of the panoramas. And in this case, we have number eight. We click on panorama actions. Show hide hotspots. And then we say on start toggle. And now by default, it, it takes me to the panorama, but I actually want the floor plan right over here and as we have number eight selected i'm going over here number eight and i say those two on start toggle just like that then i copy paste this action and i say add end toggle again and so let's see how that looks like you are here we go away and it's gone we go back again and it's there again so now we're going to do the same with the other uh, parts so we copy the two actions paste go over here zero eight you are here and then we do that with zero seven and over here the same thing and then over here the same thing Now let's preview this. You are here. You are here. And you are here. So that's the first part of the tutorial. Now the second part of the tutorial is to have the checkboxes next to them. So we go back to 3D Vista. We go to the floor plans, the hotspots. Right over here, I've got an image on top of it. I called that check uh, accordingly with the uh, number of the panorama, eight. And I have the same with seven and six. And with those, I want a slightly different logic. So I go back to the panoramas. Let's select number eight, show height hotspots. And then we say on start height. We select the floor plan from number eight. We hide the check. And the reason for that has to do with the layering. Sometimes the check will be on top of it and it looks a little bit weird because it will be on top of the UR here. So for that reason, we always want to make sure that the check is always hidden when you enter the panorama. So entering the panorama, always hide the check, even though whether it's there or not, it doesn't matter. So we say, okay. And then we copy paste this and then we say on or at end show this 08 check and we say done we preview this and we're going to check the results and as you can see we got the check we can go back to the, the first one and now you can see 
the check is not on top of the UI here. So that's why we're always hiding it when we arrive there. And we leave again and it's checked. So now it's just a matter of copy pasting those two actions and applying the same to number seven and six. Copy, paste again. And then we say zero seven check. Zero seven check. And the same with number six. We'll preview this. And as you can see, we've got it working out. So this is how you do it. I hope this video has been uh, helpful. If you'd like to learn more, feel free to join our community. The product in here you're looking at is the Loft Gallery. Uh, this link is in the description below. Thank you for your time. Have a great day and see you in the next video.